let's resume with part two of my comparison video. And remember, look for something positive in every day, even if some days you have to look a little harder. Please enjoy the video. It's bigger, but both great totes. Now we're going to compare the retro Russell to the Florentine Russell. Uh, they are about, about the same height and they're I want to say they're about the same on the bottom. They're just built different. Even though they're both Russell bags, they're from different collections. So, uh, I would say they're comparable. The retro is About the same, they're about the same length. Even you can look at them from this angle. They are about about the same size. I guess I sh if I could have stuffed them, but then I wouldn't have been able to like pair them up like this. But they are about the same size. And I was one of the ones that thought the Russell was smaller, but it's not. It's just a different leather. And they both, this retro Russell has the red lining. It's colored with the flaps to the the zipper so it zips and the zipper fits quite nicely there same strap drop length same luggage tag same back zipper compartment nice big pocket in the back same interior dooney setup really similar back zip pocket slip pocket the two front zips the only difference is this one it has the snap closure on the big slip pocket, the small slip pocket, and the key keeper is black nylon instead of that brown nylon, but they're both nylon. They both have gunmetal hardware. Um, this one has that nice, imprint uh Dooney and Burt logo imprinted all over the leather which I love I also have this bag in the small it's yellow but and it has that nice nice sort of uh like a beige or off-white. I don't think it's quite yellow, but that top stitching across around the bottom where this one is just completely, completely smooth. It has that nice stitching detail as well, but it's Florentine, so it's not, it doesn't have this, um, this edging it doesn't have this it's just smooth up and down smooth up and down but 
They both have these great duck bill uh, handles. They both have the rolled handles with the nice stitching. Now, this bag is a bit older. This is more new. I just got this bag uh, Black Friday. Last Black Friday. And I've had this bag Ooh. I've had this bag for a minute. Uh, didn't quite get it when they were like 99 bucks on I Love Doomy. Um, my girlfriend got a, a Lexington in this same color and I loved her bag. And while I was on the hunt for her bag, I found the Russell. And I've had this bag for a couple of years now. So her handles are a little bit more pliable. The new Russell, her handles are a little more rigid because she's new. She has... You know, she has some growing to do, so she's still fairly stiff. But this one, she's a little bit more relaxed. But I think they are the same size. Just, this one is puddling a little more because it's Florentine, it's softer leather, and there's nothing in her, but she stands up just fine on her own, as does this one. And they'll stand up even straighter once I stuff them and put them away. But um, if I have failed to give you any information that you're looking for on either one of these bags, drop me a comment below or feel free to email me. I always put my email and information in the in the information box below the video. Um, but really, it's nothing more really that I could compare. Um, really, these Russells are you're comparing apples, pretty much apples to apples. It's just two different collections. That's all. This collection is no longer in production, so the only way, only place you can find this bag is on the secondary market, and she definitely won't be ninety nine dollars. And this bag here, the red is not available, but I uh, believe the black is on sale in the Dooney Winter Sale going on right now. So if you're on the fence about Russell, uh, please ask me any questions that you want. Yes, she does not pass the elbow test at all. She does not. She sits very close underneath my arm, which is actually a preference of mine. I prefer that my totes sit up under my arm, especially because I commute to work on public transportation and I definitely need to know that my bags are secure. So any questions you have, I'm more than willing to answer. Um, but other than that, this is what I have as a comparison. If you need to see anything else, drop me a comment, drop me an email and I'll do what I can to get you pictures. Other than that, I'll see you guys in the next video. If you like my videos, subscribe to my channel. Give me a like. At least interact with me. Leave a comment. I'm just saying, as Mrs. Q would say. But until the next video, bye.